everybody. Oh, I'm yelling at myself. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> Growing up on White Mesa, before the mill was there, was great. Mother Earth was so strong back then. I mean, we could go out and do whatever we wanted before where the mill was sitting, but now it's hard because Mother Earth is taking a long time to regrow all the plants that, that she used to plenish back then in the day. I want my community to have a good um, air quality, good water resource. My goal is to close it or to shut it down completely. We fought this for a long time. We fought this monster for a long time. Now it's time to lay it to rest. It's, it's hard for us. Our water, our water don't smell the same. It, you have to let it run for about 15 or 20 minutes in the morning or else boil it. And that's what we bathe in. That's what we wash in. That's what we brush our teeth in. I'd like people to know that, you know, if they get behind us and help us fight this thing, like I said, the monster, the only way to get it is get it when the monster's asleep and get them out of there, you know. It is time for us guys to start fighting even more. Let's see if we can get it stopped. I don't want the mill to be um, near our reservation. It's only five miles north of our reservation. Um, I want, you know, I want clean, clean um, environment for our for our community. You know, I would li really like to have you know put my put the word out there, let people come and support us, and let them know you know what we're going through in our community. Let them see our community, and let them see how the meal is. So I'm standing here in front of the Capitol now. I want them to know how we feel because we live there and that's our homeland and that I will never leave my homeland for anything because that's where I was raised and I was grown up. Don't be scared. <laughs>